back down the shit again. You're going to have to forgive the noise. Pumps. Can't really stop that around here. Um, I'm going to start uh, attempting another graphite rubbing of uh, one of the mechlets. Now I'm actually going to grab this because um, I'm still a bit concerned about the oils and that, so I'm going to actually clean it down with some isopropyl alcohol, so it doesn't really matter that I'm touching it right now. Um, it's nice and smooth. Uh, it's a little bit of bumpage, but that's you know, that's just paints and stuff like that. Uh, so, but as a test piece, it's going to be perfectly well. Um, so yeah, I'm going to rub it with a bit of isopropyl alcohol, and then hit it with some graphite powder and see how how it looks. Uh, one thing to note: I've got a bit of foam down. Normally, we would use paper, but because this is a, a two-sided piece, I think foam is going to be soft. I'm not going to end up with any kind of scratches or anything like that. Plus, it's a bit of shitty, shitty foam. I don't particularly care if it gets covered in graphite or gets ruined. Um, so yeah, let's get onto it. So, once again, not really happy with how this turned out. Um, I think the paint's probably just a little bit shit. But one thing I did notice is that, weirdly enough, I'm getting some some marks here, which are actually really super reflective, but I think it might just be something that's rubbed while I was on there. So it might just be that this is just not smooth enough. Uh, as I said, no oil. I've, I wiped it down. I'm wearing gloves. It's still getting covered in graphite, but and no, it's it's. I don't know. <laughs> I, I honestly, uh, I'm not entirely sure what's going on here. Um, it may just be again. It may just be the paint. I might need to get some lacquer. I might need to uh, rub it down with some higher quality. Uh, wet and dry, and this is 600, which is pretty good. Uh, I almost got up to 1200, which is essentially just rubbing it with paper. Uh, it's probably not, but it's, that's funny. Cut that out. Yeah, it's a great technique. I just, it's just not working for me as much as I would like, and I'm getting these, I'm getting these weird, uh, I'm getting these weird effects with it. I might just quickly do. I don't want to it. If I just rub this a little bit, get one of those, get a bit of graphite. Yeah, it might actually work if I take the top off the graphite. If I just get a little bit of graphite, I'll just rub this just a little bit, as you can see, just rub it a little bit. Bit of graphite. 
Ooh, use a old cotton pad here. Let's see, let's see if I rub that in. Definitely not what's see it's gone really dull. That's not what I want. So it's obviously I think it's probably the paint itself. I mean it's it's obviously just not because you got some, even though this has been sprayed, it's streaking as well. So that's obviously something to do with the um as I'm rubbing it in. Even though I'm not really putting any pressure on this, I just I'm just literally just trying to move it around. Even when I'm buff, I'm, I'm probably putting a little bit more extra effort on the buff. But it's no, 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 it's just not working. I'm gonna try. I'll try it with the black. Maybe maybe the black might hide the crimes a bit better, and the white just doesn't. Uh, it also, as I said, it also could be the fact that I'm using essentially a really cheap paint. So it might be worth going over this with. I might rub it down with the uh, with some higher grade wet and dry. Maybe get a can of some better paint. I really don't want to rely too much on um, can paint. I might just get some. Um, might do with an airbrush. Problem with a tin can, you get what's called the orange peel effect, whereas the uh, it tends to pit. So that could also be an issue is that the pitting is uh, the, the pitting quality of the paint itself is not good. That being said, I can still use the white as undercoats and stuff like that. I can still use them as primers. So they're not in, you know they're not entirely at waste. But yeah, I'm really not happy with uh, how this is uh, has, how this has come out. So <sighs> till next time.